Hey, what up, guys? It is the Sugar again, and welcome back to Victoria 2. Today, we are continuing the Hearts of... Uh, no, Heart of Darkness campaign. I was going to say Hearts of Iron campaign there. Heart of, Heart of Darkness, yes. Uh, we were playing as the Prussians. Uh, recently, we've had a war against Austria, um, giving us Saxony, or putting it under our sphere of influence, at least, which is uh, required. Uh, I found the uh, uh, nationality map mode to be uh, quite handy. Uh, this way, I can sort of see what I need to to have in order to form Germany. And for the moment, all of these are actually mine, but what I forgot to do when fighting Denmark was to acquire Flensburg. Um, as you can tell, this is what I need. Uh, they're all North German. Uh, Hanover is, of course, um, something that I don't control that is covering up the rest of it. Um, but as I said, as soon as the king dies, uh, they'll just, you know, they'll be freed from British uh, control or sphere. Oh wait, have they already? Hmm. That must have already happened. Hmm. Odd. Hmm. Hmm. That's extremely odd. Um, Hanover, Hanover, Hanover. Well, once we get it to 200, we can probably sphere them. That would be amazing. Uh, then this would take uh, a lot less time and we could get going to form Germany. Uh, at least North Germany. Um, what we need to do is to, first of all, fight the Denmark over Flensburg, of course. Uh, but yeah, this nationality map mode came quite in handy. But the rest are in my sphere, so that's basically what's left to do. Uh, yes. Hmm. Sort of instance. Yeah, yeah, these are of Prussia, good. But they're being inf influenced by other countries as well. Austria is at one here. Yeah, okay. United Kingdom 25, Prussia 35. Oldenburg 100, 100. Yeah, we need to get Flensburg, bastards. Alright, Denmark, we're going to war again. Uh, I need to acquire a state. Or do I need to... Atmosphere? No, I, mean, I need to actually acquire a state. Um, we'll acquire 12 infamy in total. But this is... This has to be done. I'm sorry, guys. Um, you bastards. Give me bloody military axis. Okay, we've got 10 infamy. That's going to go down quite quickly, as you can tell. Uh, there we go. I always go for the, the middle thing. Seems to be the most effective one. So as soon as we've done forming Germany, we can relax for a while. Uh, hmm. There we go. Whoa, 100%. Conservative and reactionary parties. Oh my god. 100%. So not a single one voted for anything else. Holy crap. Well, as long as they can build factories, which they seem to be able to do. Um, well, it's all good then, I guess. It's black consumption. Chinguist. Uh, hardly any rebels around. I think everyone's fairly happy, to be quite honest. Not going to release any nations, of course. Um, so, yeah, as soon as we get this uh, done, we can uh, go to war. And I don't think we'll need more than 42,000 men to to bring down the Danish. I think that'll be just enough. But I'll, I'll keep some reserves around here. What, what did that just say? To neutral, okay. France is going to be an upcoming enemy, but i have you know, keeping myself uh, fairly uh, on good terms with the UK, which is always good. Um, so that should always uh, make things easier in the future. Life rating is too low here, so we can't do anything. Um, Spain could become a future problem as well. If they end up in a war with, uh, with the UK, I'll, I'll join in and I'll take this part down here. Uh, but I can't, I can't demand too many things because my, my infamy would go too high. So, so having that said, I think everyone everything's pretty much cleared up. Um, 
War justification. 218 days. Hmm. Nice. Sues. Exotic animals. Prestige. Goes up. 141. You can read the newspaper while we wait. Now your prices are aside to a war between Afghanistan and Bukhara. Prices collapse. Invention. Invention. Breakthrough in the USA. Scientists in the USA. The reason could be used into idealism. Idealism. The fears of Moderna. Revolution in Denmark. That came handy. For the war. Uh, you know what? I think I'll take the entire Danish Schleswig Holstein down here. Um, seeing as I have to acquire a province that would uh, allow me to form the Prussian nation. I hope now that Hanover should soon be in our sphere of influence. I hope, I hope. Hmm, interesting. So now we just need to wait until this goes up. This should increase steadily. Ah, look at this, look at this. Interesting. British is going against the war against Sulu now. Okay, because his belly speed went down. Everyone's becoming so militant. All reason they don't understand why. Do they want to change something? Polish liberation movement. It's nine hundred and eighteen. There's a lot of them, but only nine hundred and eighteen supporters. Vault risk is zero. One Prussian reactionaries. Okay, we're becoming liberal and all that. I, I mean, it's nothing that I personally care about. As long as, as long as, as long as we're capitalists and as long as people build bloody factories and, you know, that's gonna make the country prosper. So I'm all good with that. Crime fighting rate. Put an army down there too. To uh, help out. Um, see here. Everything's looking pretty good. I'm going to go through the budget. Or the production rather said. Uh, just invest in all the projects. That I can invest in. Uh, do all that. It's going up now. Hopefully they finish building all of these. Because I can't build any myself. So I have to just hand over my money to the... Uh, to my uh, my my uh, capitalists, and they will build it for me. I guess that works pretty good as well. Nice uh, railroad line down here. I like it that they added that to the map so that you can see it. Looks kind of cool. France doesn't have any railroads. Brussels got a quite, quite an advanced one over here. Same with Britain. Belgium, to be to be honest. Um, what we doing? Okay. okay. Ooh, the United Kingdom goes to war against Sulu now. This is interesting. It's going to be fighting down here. It's quite a big army, but I think the Fourteenth Army here of the British will beat them. The MP of the Sulu. Hundred and sixty. It's good. Have we got our war? Ready? Yep, declare war. Acquire state. Danish Schleswig Holstein. Yeah, I'll call my allies. Because why the hell not? Maybe I shouldn't have called my allies. But, oh, fuck it. F it. I should like to put it. F it. Take that. Take that. That should be enough, actually. It would not. Now we need more. More score. Let's just take this. Take this. Take this. That should be enough. This war wasn't going to last for long anyways. Uh, yeah. Take that. There we go. Nice. We can send the troops home. 
So, the British, yes, yes, I'm sorry for that. Um, let's just forget what happened and uh, be friends again. Next time, in s small wars as such, I will not call allies, I think. Oh, another Max National Focus. It's brilliant. Um, realism. And let's encourage... We are already encouraging capitalists there. Down here in Breslau. More capitalists. Good areas. There we go. Maybe the Rhineland would be better for it. You know what? I think I'll, I'll encourage them here. And then I'll remove these in Breslau. Yeah. Sounds like a fair idea. Where are they? Yeah, but where is this? It's in, it's in Schleichen. Schleich, Schleich, Schleich. There we go. Encourage them down there instead. Okay, armies are coming home now again. Hmm. Gaining prestige in there. Why have we gone down? The Russians have climbed above us. Barely any industrial power, but their army is incredibly big. Almost as big as the UK's. Oh yeah, the Caribbean War should take place soon, shouldn't it? Sulu Wars. Let's exploit the colonial uh, assets, of course. Of course. What's what's the point of it otherwise? Belgium's gonna go rough on the on the Netherlands here again. Interesting, interesting. Highly interesting. Look at them. They're just guarding my areas up here. Beautiful. Or it's because they can't move back down, but still, if, if anyone wants to mess with me. Uh, let's just talk about Hanover a bit more, just increase the relations a bit more. Assume we should be able to add them to our sphere. I wonder what we actually require now. Oh, we, oh, alright, we can, okay. Nice, alright, so now, now we should be able to form the North German Confederation. Ta-da! Oh my god, how beautiful, isn't it? We've done it. We've done it. With your help. And everyone else is... Oh, this is fucking amazing. Look at that. That puts us right at number two. Bam. Look at that power. Well, the industrial power could get better, but the rest is just amazing. Wow. What a bloody... Achievement. I am happy that this is this has come to my attention and that this has happened. Um, really, I could just right now relax. The rest is gonna handle itself for me. Really, uh, we need to be careful with the um, with this though. But I think everyone's pretty much happy that this has occurred. Conservative, liberal, and uh, reactionary. There's gonna be people who want to do this and that. Suffrage movement. Yeah. What do they want? Wealth weighted voting. Well, I shall change it. Where's the wealth? They waited voting. When I can, I will. As soon as I can, I will. I'd hate to have people rising up to fight against me over some something like this. Uh, first army and third army. The Russians. Allied with France. Bavaria. Austria. Hmm. Could only just be a bit more friendly with uh, the Mr. France. Doesn't really hurt, does it? Let's go spread my armies out a bit in case of a future clash with any of the other powers, but right now this is this is great. I quite like it. North German Confederation. Hopefully we can form the entirety of it, the German Empire. Um let's me see what we will require for that. I don't think it's anything that's too hard to get. Just continue doing this. Uh, foreign investment. Can we? Can we? Oh, we can. Of course, of course. Uh, uh, other. Let's pause. So, there's hardly any in my sphere of influence now, seeing as I 
didn't. But all the these guys. Uh, okay, I cannot. Denmark, I cannot. Um, I'll go for all the German states, really. Um, have I got anything spent? No, absolutely nothing. We'll do uh, the Netherlands. They're about to be conquered soon. Maybe that would be kind of bad. Um, I'll go for some, some Austrian states here. I'll build some factories. Um... Uh, I'll build a cement factory. And I will build in Bavaria. Uh, I'll begin with the minor investment in Baden. Yeah, that seems fair enough. Um, Krakow, no. Württemberg? Yeah. No. The Bavaria instead. Uh, I'll open this one. Yeah. So now we're building here. And we've also got a little factory down here in Baden. Which is good. Now I still gotta take a look at the uh, decisions though. Uh, three hurrahs for Germany. Uh. German, okay, okay. North German, okay. So we need to start owning territories down here in order to do that. It's just the sphere of influence as it is right now. Nationality, South German. Wow, that would be quite intense. That is a, that's one hell of an empire. Uh, so I would need to acquire... All this down here, and all this. Uh, so I guess it's Austria that we're heading to war with, if there was to be anything. Um, won't do that now, though. Of course, we're, we need more diplom diplomatic points. But I think I'll 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 wait until we head into the fifties, at least, until I go to war against them again. Because right now I am happy as it is. Okay, the liberals lost some votes. Life rating is too bad. I guess this begins later on. The Spanish are standing on my doorstep. No idea. Bastards. Good riddance. Okay. Committee for Polish Independence. In Paris, the Committee of Polish was founded to support the movement for Polish Independence in Russia, Austria, Hungary, and Prussia. So, Poland shall be kept off the map. Alright. Gain some bullshit there. They're quite a big nationality, of course. <laughs> sphere of influence. I'm wondering if I should sphere a few more. Neptune discover, and then we, and then there were eight. Good, good, to, good to get some extra prestige. The Netherlands. I'm gonna actually gonna prioritize the Netherlands right now. Uh, Baden, not exactly. Tuscany. Whoever's in Austrian sphere of influence should be prioritized by me. I can't, though, because I'm a truce with them, apparently. Alright, I see. Just because I recently had a war with them, of course. All pops in Frankfurt gain five, four militancy. Bastards. This goes down over time, I hope, but still, it's, it's nasty. Interesting. Oh, it's called the Zeiten now, the Times or something. Huh. <laughs> Interesting that they changed it. Yeah. So many liberals. As long as they build my bloody factories, I'm I'm fine. Budgets, production, projects, more projects, alright. Oh wait, can we? No. I thought I, I thought I could add factories. But I can expand them. I will expand the factories. And I'll It'll cost me money, but it's money I definitely have and that I won't really use for anything in particularly different as for now. So I'll expand all these factories. I see that it's good for the future. Of course, subsidize all the 
projects that need it. All right. So this region nationalists. <sighs> Funny. Send these guys out to wipe them out of the face of the earth. And so they were gone. Okay, so the Belgians are attacking the Netherlands now. Poor Netherlands. It'd be quite nice to have Friesland though. Not gonna lie, who are they allied with? Uh, Sweden and Spain. So if I went to war with them, I would technically go to war with Spain, which would allow me to... Then again, Spain's at war with France. Do I really need that province of Friesland, though? Technically, right now, I won't even get it, seeing as France is occupying it. Interesting changes are occurring to the world right now, I've got to say. Hmm. Wow, France is even invading Sweden. This is quite negative, as seeing as I wouldn't want to have France grow that powerful if they now decide to take it. That could just be for war score. Yeah, they pieced out on Sweden there. Ah, interesting, interesting. Good. Between Belgium and Netherlands. On 2nd of May 1846, Belgium announced that the state of war now exists between them and the Netherlands. The foreign minister of Belgium, when asked for the reasons we had acquired Gilderland, we only intend to reclaim what was unjustly claimed before. I see. Fears of Switzerland. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Let it operate. I'm going to be nice to people. We'll see what happens to uh, to the Netherlands now after this. Looks like it's not nice to be up against Belgium and France. But the the, the Netherlands allies or Netherlands allies did step in, seeing as Spain and all those fought with them. Uh, yeah, they're probably definitely gonna lose something in this though. Set a little research. Um, yeah, posit positiv positivism. That sounds great. Can't wait until I can start colonizing all this. Um, allies with Austria, Netherlands, and Portugal. Now, I'm not going to go to war anyone with anyone just yet. Um, doesn't feel like it's necessary. Interesting. Who did the UK go to war with? Johore. Johore. Is that down here? Hmm, or is it down here? Could be somewhere else as well, not really sure. Oh, great. Why do I always have to make a decision? Why can't I just, hmm, just, just say, hmm, and then let the rest carry itself out? Um, hint at policy changes. I'm not, I don't want to be a suppressive power. I don't want to, like, you know, have, like, a really high... Um, class factory just expanded here in Berlin. Don't really want to have a high militancy in my country. I want people to be happy. It's it's kind of hard. There's always going to be movements. Look at this shit. So, can we change? No, we cannot. Because we just got to wait until the majority of the population wants it. Perhaps votes yes. Which is good, I guess. Beer halls will be removed from Kreuznach. Cannot act at this time. I'm afraid that this militancy is going to just boil over soon. What's this? Grievous insults. We must respect and tolerate difference between our respective cultures. Uh, Cinder. Fuck Cinder. I don't give a fuck about Cinder. Where's Cinder? Major war is going around the country right now. Or the, uh, the world, should I say. I could have sworn there were Cindy were somewhere around here. Look at these uncolonized grounds. 
Well, Cindy will remain a little speck on the map. As far as I'm concerned, so nothing to worry about. Look at the money we've gained since we last invested. Holy crap. This is good stuff, I have to say. We can even lower the tariffs now. No, we could not, because that's what we were relying on. But we can lower them a bit. 20% instead of 25 or whatever they used to be at. Uh, still seems like we're losing money. But just a few percentage and increase will put us back on track. Yeah, I think it was up here somewhere. Well, this is good. More export. Feels good to have the German Empire. Feels good. Gotta say. Ah. They want me to vote. Let me vote. Let me change it, at least. Because I've got to wait for some time. Some nationalists are Prussian nationalists. Uh, the revolt risk is zero, though. There's just people gathering to to vote for it. Campaign for free press. Yeah, I could imagine that. Why not? It's going to increase a hell of a lot of, um, you know, consciousness, though. But whatever. All my armies are going to hunt for rebels now. So if anything pops up, they'll go there. Uh, fears of Greece, Papal States Relations. Oh, what's this? The Liberator. A new daily has begun circling in the Herald. Carrying hard-hitting political commentary and liberi, li literary, literary critique and local news. Has quickly developed into a flagship of local liberal politics. Censor the paper, of course. Bastards. Anyways, let's go with a little... Um, Market structure. We'll jump into that. Uh, give me some positive events, please. Anyways, we've climbed up again to number two. Looks like our industrial power has increased as well. We're above France now, feels good. Military wise, we're stronger than them. Prestige wise is one. Not factory, though, or industrially. So they decided to take nothing. Uh, why they fought them, I do not know, but it's... <laughs> I feel kind of bad for, um, for the Dutch, in all honesty. I, it feels kind of shit to be in their position, I think. I should acquire Friesland, though. That would be quite smart of me. I would be thrown into a war against Spain, which I could definitely deal with without any problem. And Sweden, of course, if they now chose to join. Um... I'm going to ally myself with Sweden in case of a future war, and I hope that they would take my side. Netherlands, Spain. Nothing I can do anything about. They wouldn't accept that. And my relations are kind of bad with them, so... Sooner or later, sooner or later something's going to happen, but um, Friesland is definitely something that's in my target scope right now. Anyways, thank you everyone for watching. I think we're going to about end it here. Uh, we're just going to research this market structure and then we'll be done with it. Um, realistic art and all that. This is good. Uh, I really do need to change... Oh, there we go. Weighted wealth. Wait, who wants... Wait. Let's see what we'll do. Campaign for free press. Ah. There we go. That went away quite quickly. That's good. And the Jackman rebels are decreasing now, it seems. Or Jacobin rebels. And then we're just going to get this weighted wealth up and going, and then we'll be fine. Restore the Academia is not very good at all. Build the Kiel Canal. Machine tools, nitroglycerin, and iron steamers. Hmm. 
could come in handy. Alright guys, we're going to end it here. Thank you all for watching. Um, new election. Interesting. Uh, but yeah, before we go too far in, um, you guys come up with a good idea of what I should do next. Now that we've formed the North German Federation. And uh, I will see you guys later. Until then, ciao.